Hi and welcome to our lesson on telling the time. In this lesson we will be looking at quarter past the hour. This is the minute hand. It tells us how many minutes have passed. When it completes a full turn, this means that a whole hour has passed. This is the hour hand. It tells us how many hours have passed. The time shown is one o'clock. From here, the minute hand moves around to the three. It has moved one quarter of the way around the clock. The hour hand has moved one quarter of the way past one. The time is quarter past one. This time we'll start at four o'clock. The minute hand moves one quarter of the way around the clock to three. This means that the time will be quarter past. The hour hand is a quarter of the way past four. So the time is quarter past four. This time we'll start at seven o'clock. From here, the minute hand moves a quarter of the way around the clock to three. So we know the time will be quarter past. The hour hand is a quarter of the way past seven. So the time is quarter past seven. Finally, we'll start at 12 o'clock. The minute hand moves around to three. So the time will be quarter past. The hour hand is past 12, so the time is quarter past 12. Here are some questions for you to try. Write down the times shown. Pause the video and have a go. Question 1. The minute hand is pointing to 3, so it's quarter past. The hour hand has moved past two, so the time is quarter past two. Question two. The minute hand is pointing to three, which is quarter past. The hour hand is just past five, so the time is quarter past five. Question three. The minute hand is at three, so quarter past. The hour hand is just past eight. The time is quarter past eight. Question four. The minute hand is at three, so quarter past. The hour hand is past 10, so the time is quarter past 10. Thank you for watching. If you'd like further practice, more questions are available on our website.